The new Diamond League field event rules applied in the women's shot put. It meant that Michelle Carter, the world indoor champion, didn't advance through. She wasn't in the top four after three rounds, and it left the way for a new name to really make her mark. This is Emil Dorelli of Turkey, who set a new national record, just 20 years of age, improving all the time. And in the final round, it was a second national record of the competition, 1857. That would be good enough for third place. And in the fifth round, Anita Martin, who'd finished behind Michelle Carter in Portland back in March, produced her best throw of the competition of 1922, a season's best for the Hungarian. Well, we thought it might be an American who'd win it, but perhaps not Tia Brooks. And she was in superb form, has already set a personal best earlier this season, about three weeks ago in Chula Vista, 1937. Well, she went even better in the third round today. A new best of 1948. And that good enough, easily good enough to win the competition. Maximum points for Tia Brooks. And a good night's work for her. As I said, disappointment for Michelle Carter, finishing down in fifth place. There's the full result then, a new national record, as I said, for the 20-year-old. Watch out for her in the coming competitions. Martin and Brooks getting six points and ten points respectively, one all the way down for six with Guba.